Hi everyone, my name is Waja Sanil Taf. I am a graduate student at the Earth and Environmental Science Department. Today I will talk about my project based on pore characterization. The title of my project is Exploring the Pore System of the New Albany Shale Using Complementary Pore Characterization Techniques. Pore characterization is vital for unlocking the hydrocarbon potential of shale, revealing a complex pore network that dictates fluid and gas flow dynamics essential for efficient extraction. The New Albany Shale has emerged as a major unconventional hydrocarbon resource offering substantial potential for oil and gas extraction due to its organic rich content and complex port structure. Our research deciphers the port system of New Albany Shale and its significance for hydrocarbon extraction. We have collected core samples from four wells in Illinois and Indiana. Our goal was to do a detailed analysis of its pore structure uh, which complicates hydrocarbon extraction. We used two set of techniques. In the first set, we are using petrographic microscope for grain size distribution and fractures. We also used SEM for uh, pore size distribution, microfractures, and pore types. For the identification, quantification, and relative abundance of minerals, we used XRD. We used MIP for pore throat size distribution edge accessible porosity and permeability. We also used uh, nitrogen adsorption and small angle X-ray scattering for pore size, pore shapes and surface area distribution. As we can see the photomicrographs highlighting spherical site, dolomite, pyrite, alginite and biogenic content at varying magnifications. Figure 4 presents isotherm adsorption and desorption curves highlighting the variation in pore volume and surface area of the shale under different pressure conditions. The New Albany shale is characterized by high clay content as we can see from the XRD results. Figure 6 is showing the significant variability in pore sizes within the New Albany shale as indicated by variations in pore surface area in both transverse and parallel direction. The small angle X-ray scattering results revealed an average pore size diameter of 1 to 5 nanometer. SEM observations revealed diverse pore structures including uniformly distributed pyrite framboids indicative of anoxic conditions and a range of pore types such as interparticle and inter intraparticle pores as well as fractures. The MIP analysis indicated the, that the majority of pore throat diameters range from 2.8 to 50 nanometer and mercury intrusion pore asymmetry curve with the peaks representing the pore size distribution linking incremental pore volume to intrusion pressure. All of these techniques have some pros and cons. For example, the nitrogen resorption and small angle X-ray scattering are non-destructive and suitable for micro to mesopores. However, the SEM offers high resolution surface imaging and MIP excels in micropore analysis. However, each technique has some limitations such as specific pore size ranges that they can analyze and in some cases potential alteration of pore structure. Overall, the New Albany shares diverse uh, pore network abundant in nanopores and organic matter significantly amplifies its uh, hydrocarbon adsorption capacity and uh, while its brittle minerals offer potential for enhanced permeability through fracture networks. However, the pore shapes and connectivity flagged by nitrogen adsorption along with the prevalence of micro to mesopores from MIP results could restrict fluid flow, suggesting that reservoir stimulation is necessary to improve extraction. Thank you for your attention.